All right, good day, welcome. So, Virgo, this is your February reading, but it doesn't really have to be, I'm just putting it out for the month of February. My readings are timeless, all right? So anytime you stumble upon it, all right? Everybody's situation happens at different times, so, all right? So this is general, obviously, all right? I focus on Virgo energy, and I get whatever is the strongest, all right? So feel free to hit that like, subscribe, and share. Feel free to leave a comment as long as it's not rude. We don't do that stuff here, so. All right, Virgos, what do we have for the Virgos? Virgos. Virgos. What do we have for Virgo? What are the Virgos dealing with? What is the majority of Virgos dealing with here? Some turnover? Oh, we got a date. Heart with the key. Wow. All right, so shows here that you might be um, meeting someone new. Or some of you are just ready to welcome love, get back out there again. Some of you guys are going to meet someone new. You're going to get together. All right, you just got to open your heart. All right, for some of you, the one you meet will be the one. All right, people need to be careful. What is going on with my deck here? All right, let's try this again. So maybe you meet somebody, you guys end up wanting to get together, set a date, plan on it. And for some of you, you're getting back into the dating scene. But you got to open your heart, all right? So we have literally here the seduction card. All right, so you like to flirt. You like to have some fun here. I don't know. Maybe you were, like, done dirty in the past. So, you know, you're just kind of having fun, dating, hooking up. I feel like you're, you know, obviously a temptation. Or maybe you just feed into temptation. All right? Maybe you're just one of those people that just isn't, like, into commitment. I mean, I don't knock anybody's stuff. I mean, everybody's who they are. All right? I mean, to be honest, if you really look at human evolution... Yeah. All right. A lot of people are the way they are because of like conditioning. All right. Um, but do your thing, whatever works for you, you know, as long as you're being safe and, you know, not spreading a bunch of crap around, you know, and yeah. But do you do what makes you happy? Do what, you know, is like hurting people and shit you know try to reframe from that if possible all right so let's see what we've got going on here virgos little pep talk there i guess right all right what do we got for virgos here for the virgs virgo 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 so we have the six of swords so yeah you're ready you're moving on you're moving on from whatever all right, maybe things weren't going the way you had anticipated. Things are kind of really, kind of, it's like things have kind of slowed down a little bit here. And I feel like you're just kind of thinking like, maybe I need to just move on. Nothing's really taking off, you know, it's almost like kind of like stagnating. But with the Six of Swords, yeah, you're ready to move on. You're ready to meet somebody new. You're ready to get back out there, all right? Two of Wands, yeah. You're made, you've made a decision. You're getting, you know, close to just renewal here. So maybe you're just going to end up just going out having a good time, you know, not really committing yourself. Yeah, we have the 
Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, you're really, I, that, I don't know when that one flipped, but yeah, some of you are going to meet the one and it's going to be the one. All right, with the Ace of Pentacles, heart with the keys. Some of you are really going to be taken by surprise, I feel. All right. It's like, this is going to be a beautiful union, Prince of Cups. It's going to be a big surprise, a happy surprise. Six of Cups, all right. It could be somebody from your past, or it could just be, you know, somebody that you feel good around. All right. But I feel like it could be somebody from maybe your childhood or somebody from your past of some sort. All right. But for some of you, it's like, yeah. I don't know if some of you, it's going to be if it's somebody, you know, that you may have been with before. But. Let's see what else we've got for the Virgos. So we got the Princess of Cups in the reverse. How I see that is with the Prince and with the Prince of Cups in the upright is and seeing that, you know, I feel like you put a lot of emotion into your last relationship. All right. Yeah, see so you don't want any commitments with the four of wands in the reverse. All right, it's like, and now you're you're cutting off emotion is what I'm getting here. All right. But that's usually what happens because there was something that pained you, something that, hold on one sec, guys.